chào các bạn. Hello everyone, welcome to the Nail Tip Show. Today I'll be doing a quick tutorial uh, with fall inspired nails. So I'm just using a dry leaf. So this is, I think this is pretty cool for the season and I just thought this is so cool and easy. So I want to share with you and so let's get started. Hôm nay em sẽ chia sẻ với các bạn một cái nail làm với bột ha Nhưng mà cũng rất là dễ là tại vì em chỉ dùng những cái bông, cái lá khô này là mình sẽ gây cánh lên cái móng Rồi mình chỉ làm rất là nhanh và gọn Bây giờ chúng ta cùng bắt đầu So for today's look, I'm just gonna use a, a pumpkin spice from DCH acrylic blending system and a clear So it's easy, like I said, easy fun, okay? So To start off, I already prepped the nail and then I'm gonna use um, Koopa form. Do you know I love this form? So yeah, I'm just gonna, I already prepped and then I'm just gonna add the form. If you guys wanna see more details on how I apply the form, you can look, there's a video on it. I'm just gonna stay with, uh, keep it the same as this, which is the coffin look. So, uh, the, I mean coffin shape. So I'm just gonna keep that, that way you guys can want to watch the full tutorial on that one that's a link to it các bạn nào muốn coi cái cách mà em làm cái ballerina nail shape với cái form á em có làm sẵn cái video đó các bạn có thể coi ha nhưng mà hôm nay em sẽ làm um, cái này thì cho nó nhanh lên chút xíu so I'm just gonna start let me open this powder and get it started I love this look because it's so easy like I said just one color and a clear okay So now I have prepped and put the form on. I'm just gonna go in with the clear, just so I can have it like a nice base because I'm using color acrylic. I just wanna have it so then that way if I need to take it off, I don't have to file all the way down. Lúc mà các bạn làm mà cái màu bột đó, các bạn lúc nào cũng phải có cái miếng clear ở dưới ha để cho các bạn có cái nền ở dưới để các bạn có tháo ra hết đó, thì nó không có bị uh, mài xuống mỏng hết Next, I'm just gonna put a little bit of the free edge So then that way, because color powder is not gonna be as strong as clear and white powder So now I'm just gonna build my foundation a little bit So then it's gonna be stronger So now I'm just gonna take a small bead small medium between small and medium <laughs> and then I'm gonna extend out the free edge okay I'm gonna try to keep it thin you know and then I extend it out to the shape as much as possible and then I'm just gonna take another bead and use it at the tip Okay, and just use the body of the brush and pat it into the shape that you want. You want. So các bạn dùng cái cái cọ cái mình cọ ha để cho nó mình mình pat nó mình dẹp nó cái bột nó xuống theo cái shape mà mình muốn ha. I'm working very thin. That way, when I encapsulate the dry leaf, it clear. It's not gonna be bulky afterward. Now. Gonna take the same thing, not to I'm just gonna work slowly because I just want a thin foundation to begin with. I notice I need a little bit more on the side here. I'm gonna play the small peak here. Okay, I'm gonna give it for a couple minutes to dry a little bit and then I'm gonna pinch them before I put on the dry leaf, okay? So now once it's dry, you wanna pinch it, okay? Make sure you pinch a little bit so then you have a nice round C curve, okay? Now, when you want to encapsulate the dry leaf like this, I find that there's a few ways to do it, uh, different ways to do it, but I find that recently I've been using the 
uh, dipping pattern, uh, the, the glue system, the dipping pattern number two, usually number two and three, which is the, the base and the activator system. I find it, um, I find it's quicker to do it. So I'm going to show you my, my tips. Okay. So basically I'm using the number two base from Apple and number three, which is the activator. So what would you do is you put on the base first on the top of the nail. Okay. You just put the base on the entire nail or the area that you want to encapsulate it. Uh, the area that you want to encapsulate the whatever glitter or whatever you want. But I find that this is pretty cool because it dried up pretty fast. So basically, I'm just going to make sure I have everything, especially the, to the edge. Don't forget the edge, okay? And then when you place the, flower, the dry leaf or the flower, I'm just gonna try to hold it down, okay? Because doing myself is a little bit hard, but you would hold it down as tight as possible, and then you apply on number three on top. See? By doing the number three, that will cure really fast. And then you just try to hold it down. And then just put it activator on. And cure the whole, and it will cure. See it? It's really fast. And now, once it dry, I can just take a scissor. Okay, and make sure the edges. Yeah, make sure you have the edge really tight and and uh, no. And like it's so bad, so high, but so bad for the dipping system. For any dipping system, actually, các bạn muốn xài hãng nào cũng được. Nhưng mà hôm nay em xài hãng Apple hơn, em bỏ cái glue cái base trước Xong rồi em bỏ cái lá lên, em đè cái lá theo cái ý Cái chỗ mà em muốn bắt đầu em bỏ cái number 3 which is the activator Thì nó sẽ khô liền Thì nó làm như vậy á, nó bám vô rất là nhanh Và nó khô cũng rất là nhanh Thì đó, it stays like this And now I'm just gonna encapsulate with the clear And, and tie nail with the clear um, Các bạn có thể trim nó You know các bạn có trim, but usually I think I'd rather wait until after I put the clear on, so then it kind of hold down. Okay, so be your end ball, get clear, huh? You know what? I'm just gonna cut the cuticle area. You know, what? I'm gonna trim it a little bit. Get your cuticle and be like, and hold the wound, which I bam you, huh? So instead trim it at you, huh? Go get the inside. I feel like I I'd rather wait after I'm done with the clear. Just the cuticle, that way I can see where that is too. Okay. Bam, let's see. Mà nếu mà thí dụ các bạn mà thấy nó 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 hở chỗ nào, let's just say some area that's sticking out, you can also come go back to the glue a little bit, like here. Okay. Okay. And then I put number three again. And I kind of hold it down a little bit. Okay. See, that way it, it will hold down. So now I can easily go ahead and encapsulate the whole nail. So we are end up cold somewhere, huh? And set ball feet clear. See? And ball clear too. Hmm. Look at the just let the acrylic slowly going down make sure you have enough liquid put it in there as well okay and then get in the corner and same thing just gonna try to Okay. And then, okay. Just slowly flatten it down. So while I'm waiting for it to dry, I'm just gonna go ahead and trim off the excess, the extra. Cover your and like cut na her, cut na. Hold on, huh? 
rồi lúc mà đợi em trong khi đợi cái mình cắt nó ra so first thing I'm just gonna take a file and just do the edges just the bottom edges make sure everything is clean first even dry leaf I find that pretty easy to encapsulate this way too okay so now I'm gonna take my e-file I'm gonna use the three in one medium how by bit okay put it in all right okay my nail pretty long so I want to give a room and I'm using the kp60 uh, hand piece with the many pro password so be your end of your huh? so now I'm just gonna start with the bottom make sure everything nice and straight the same thing with the other side and you have been YouTube and you think that you can do it new but yeah, and you can get confusing the style and before I do that, I'm gonna make sure that I have everything lined up this one is pretty sticking out so this way is a lot um, quicker for you guys to do the you don't have to do a lot of shaping I put my uh, e file straight and just go along the side that way it helps me to kind of pull everything straight and then I'm just gonna go up and down and now I'm just gonna contour the shape and even it and smooth and everything out and the young cake cut by bit, take it three in one, huh? Cut by bit and the young girl and be soon and start to get my to get both the money soon to see her. But like be con to the cuticle area a little bit. But the dough you and I am, and be sad to see you pull down the bad paper and could be sad. The money who got that, yeah, huh? Hey, look at all you like it down the hood, the hood, John to see you. The money, then get out, huh? Hong Kong man. Mình có thể đi sát được okay. It allows you to go pretty close to the cuticle area Without cutting your client So now I'm just gonna take a file and Define everything So now I shape the way I want it. I'm just gonna change my bit to a sanding bit, the one I use when I prepped the nail. So now I'm just gonna take that with a low speed of seven or eight thousand RPM. I'm just gonna buff it. So we are in your okay, medium sanding band, or like I'm prepped the mom type way, and we are in to buff the light. Okay, and I'm done. Just gonna dust everything. Okay, it's a nice look. Just gonna clean it. Cleanser. And same thing with this nail. It looks really good when you put the top on. Okay. I'm just gonna use the gel top from Koopa. There's none um, wipe, okay? No wipe after you cure it for 60 seconds. To make it a little more fancier, I'm just gonna add some rhinestone and some beads. So I'm just gonna use part of the glitz collection that I um, collab with. So I'm just gonna take that and I'm gonna use the, the gem gel from glitz as well. Okay. And then I'm just gonna put it on the side. And yeah, we'll watch you see rhinestone, huh? Like a gem, but make it beat, huh? Yeah, and the ball, you see you know, oop. So just to wet the surface where you want it, as you can see, it looks pretty good already. But I just thought I wanna kind of add some little bling to it to brighten it up a little bit. But you can see later when I put the gloss on, it looks really cool. 
I mean, make it look so random and bald. Then tell it, tell it you, huh? Take some random sizes. So now I'm I'm pleased with where I want to place it. I'm just gonna have it here for one minute. So you add it, just here, just one minute. Sau khi một phút khô rồi ha. So now after a minute, I'm just gonna put a top coat on a tire nail and not over the crystals. Maybe just some of the beads on the side, but not the crystal, okay? But you do wanna put the brush close to the side as much as possible so then you can cover the sides as well Ok đó, xong rồi đó các bạn thấy không? Rất là đẹp mà cũng đơn giản ha Đó, sau đó I'm gonna put in the lamp for one minute Ok, so sau khi một phút là em đã xong rồi đó hoàn tất rồi đó, các bạn thấy không? Rất là bóng now I'm just gonna add about the big cuticle oil, huh? That's it. So I try not to see it, huh? Đó, các bạn thấy không? Đẹp hơn mà nhanh mà cũng dễ nữa. See, this is a quick, cool fall design. I thought it's really quick and easy, but it gives like interesting look to the fall. And I like it that you can see the vein and everything with the gloss. You can see the whole entire dry leaf on the nail. I just find that this look is very fun and cool and simple. Quick and easy, right guys? No? And somewhere, huh? So look at that. If you missed, uh, if you haven't seen this video, you can um, check this video out. But I thought with this too, it's really cool for fall inspired look. Okay guys? Okay, so that is it. I just thought I'd share a quick and easy fall inspired look. Um, again, hope you like it and try it on your client. All right, thank you so much for tuning in. Be sure to follow us on Instagram and Facebook as well. And don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Cảm ơn các bạn đã theo dõi chương trình và hẹn gặp lại chương trình kế tiếp. Bye guys!